Trading the foreign exchange market carries high risk and may not be suitable for all investors. Trading on margin and utilizing leverage can carry an even higher level of risk that can lead to a complete loss of investment funds. Before deciding to trade the foreign exchange market or using any of our software or alert products, you should carefully and digitally consider your personal investment objectives, level of experience, and risk tolerance. There is a possibility that you could potentially sustain significant loss. You should not invest or trade any capital that you cannot afford to lose. It is your responsibility to be aware of and understand all risk associated with foreign exchange trading and to seek professional advice from an independent certified financial advisor if you have any doubts. Hey, 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 familia, how's it going? This is Mario coming in with another video. Today, we're gonna be talking about something that I believe is very, very important when getting into the foreign exchange and trading space. Now, as you saw in the title of the video, we're gonna be discussing what is a MyFX book. Now, if you've never heard of MyFX book, it's a website that provides multiple, multiple things from a way to track your account all the way to like news events and an economic calendar. Now, I think it's a very, very, very useful tool in all aspects of the, of the word, but I wanna talk today specifically about the tracking tool that it offers. So, let's get to the intro and I'll see you on the other side. Cool, so let's go on Google and let's see what Google says about what a MyFX book is. According to Central Charts, MyFX book is a free automated online trading tool that enables traders to evaluate, analyze, share, and compare their trading strategies and trading account performance. If you've never used the MyFX book, uh, I'm gonna put mine right now. This is one of the MyFX books that I'm running for a trading account that I'm running on one of the EAs for a company that I'm that I'm part of called Avoria Prime. Now, if you don't know what Avoria Prime is, that's totally cool. A video should be popping up right now. And if you wanna see more of my results, then a video should be popping up right now as well. So you can go ahead and check out my results for the first quarter of 2021. The reason why I wanna talk about this today is because I believe that anybody getting into the trading space should understand what a MyFX book is because it's kind of like the first time that you buy a car. When you first buy a car, if it's a used car at least, you go to Carfax. What, what Carfax is, is a third party tool that you can use to look at the history of the car, how many times it was crashed, how many owners it has, how many miles it actually has. And it's untemperable because Carfax is not associated with any single company that sells used cars or any single specific person. They're a third party company that all they do is they keep a track and a tight record of each individual car. Now, obviously we're not talking about used cars here, but we are talking about your trading account. And when it comes to trading, since it is a profession, just like let's say any athlete would know their stats or any sort of company would know how much revenue they're gonna make over the next year without even having any sales made based on past performance, you should be able to track every single thing that is happening on either your trading account or whatever your mentor or guru is doing on their account. Now, this is a great, great tool because one, it's untemperable. I can't come in and input anything on it. All I do is I go into my account and I set it up. And if you don't know uh, how to set up a MyFX book, but you've been wanting to, I also have a video on how to do that in the simplest way to get it up and running so that you can even share it with other people. The MyFX book is very, is a very, very key component to number one, you understanding your own stats when it comes to trading. I, I have my own trading journey that I'm going through and I use a MyFX book. Outside of that as well, I use it to track the software that I like to run. And I, I'm running multiple technologies right now and I track them using using MyFX books because I wanna see what my risk to reward is. I wanna see, okay, worst case scenario, another COVID-19 hit happens in the market. What is the worst case scenario that can actually happen to my account? And that's something that is absolutely amazing to have because you can now be able to share and be able to receive documentation on different accounts. And if you're a trader and you don't have your stats, then are you really like professional in your in whatever you're doing? You might be really good at what you do. I'm not saying you're, you don't, but if at some point you wanna show somebody what level you're currently at and, and, and what your skills are, how can you prove that? You can't show me a thousand or $10,000 account that you've flip to 100,000, that means nothing to me. Why? Because big institutions don't look at that. They don't care if you flip the account. They wanna know, okay, how much did you risk? Now, if you showed me you never exceeded 5% in drawdown on the account, and you show me that you made a 100% return consistently every three to four months, 
then that's something that now we can talk about because now you're showing me proof that, okay, this is my risk versus my reward and everything in life and business and especially trading has to do with risk to reward. The reason why I love my FX books is because I can track my, my all my accounts on literally one account and then I can compare all the returns on those accounts. So let's say if I'm running two different technologies, we have, let's say an AI scalping software called Neo the Legend that trades only a certain period of the day. And obviously because it only trades a specific period of the day, it only takes small trades since it is a scalping, a scalping system. Those kind of returns are not going to be as big as if I, let's say trade gearbox on a swing method where I'm swinging the markets and I'm being in trades for a couple days or even a couple of weeks. And, and obviously the returns on gearbox are going to be much bigger, but the risk on it is also going to be increased because of the fact that I'm swinging the market and I'm letting the market kind of move and, and and flow so that's a great tool for me when it comes to testing software and then when it comes to learning about my own stats when it comes to my personal trading I think that it is absolutely powerful to know because it shows you so much information it shows you the percentage on how many longs you won, the percentage on your shorts that you won. So let's say if you put a hundred trades, 50 longs and 50 shorts, and you want half of them on each, then it's gonna say 50% and 50%. And that's something that's amazing because it continually keeps tracking it from the moment that the account started. So it's not like, oh, at the beginning of the account, you weren't doing so good and now, now towards the end, now you're doing great. So you only wanna show towards the end. You can't do that. It shows you since the account was created. So next time that you know you're talking to anybody about Forex, ask them, hey, do you have a MyFX book I could look at? Because if they don't, then I'm not saying that they're not what they're claiming is incorrect, but what I'm saying is that how can you document whatever they're saying? In my game, and at least in my book, documentation beats conversation every single time. And what made me excited to try out these AI softwares when I was also learning how to trade was the fact that I saw thousands and thousands and thousands of other people learning how to use the software without really knowing how to trade and seeing massive, massive returns over uh, a short term to long term period of time, you know, three, six, 12 months and onwards. We have a Facebook group where I was looking at everything and, and that's when I was like, hey, it's worth at least a shot. So if you're struggling right now with your trading and uh, you wanna be able to get that consistency and still be able to compound the markets without having to blow so many accounts, definitely, definitely, definitely go join that Facebook group. I'm gonna leave it in the description so you can go ahead and join it. And then text me on either Instagram or Facebook and let me know that you joined so that I can let you in. Hey, you don't have to use any software to be successful in trading, but what I've learned is that hey if you have multiple ways to be able to take from the market then you'll have more chances and the odds on your favor and the probabilities will be in your favor so with that said that this video is pretty much done i don't have anything else to say i really thank you for watching this video today i appreciate you i love you i send you so many blessings and i hope that god guides your way make sure you like this video if it really added value to your life Make sure you comment on it if you have any questions or you just wanna share something really cool for me to see later. And make sure that you subscribe and hit that notification bell because I will be updating you guys on my trading journey. I will be updating you guys on all the other passive income investments I'm gonna be doing. And if you are somebody that's hungry for financial freedom, then definitely, definitely, definitely hop on this way. I wish you nothing but the best and make sure that you stay tuned if you wanna grow spiritually, personally, and financially. Mario is out.